So now that we have our one fixture patched, we are back here in the home screen. So to go ahead and get that fixture going, we're going to click on it and select it. We're going to go over here to controls and parameters because this is a moving light. And since this is an arc fixture, the first thing we're going to do is hit lamp controls. And there we go, lamp controls and lamp on. And now you should hear the fan spin up as the fixture lamps on. Now if we just come over here to our fader, we'll bring it up, and there we go. Our fixture is up and dimmable. Now, since we have all these parameters available for control, there's a couple different ways to control them. If we want to pan or tilt the fixture, we can simply tap it with our finger, and then you can see some little green arrows pop up indicating up and down. So if I move my finger up and down, I'm right on it. I can go ahead and tilt the fixture over toward the wall. I can pan doing the same motion with my finger. And one thing I did, we did discover today is that you can connect a USB mouse to the console with the one USB connection on the back. <clears throat> so if we do that, we can simply hold with the mouse and then move the mouse up and down to get those parameters to move. Um, and this works for any of the parameters in here. So let's say we go ahead and zoom, open the zoom a little bit so we get that a little bigger. And now we can go ahead and focus as well. So we go to focus and move that up and down. Move it up some more. And there we go. Now we're in focus. And um, for there's other options in here, like you've got your colors. You can either scroll around or you can just point and choose which color you want. And they, they do have the different uh, color swatches on there. This fixture has a uh, color wheel only, not RGB, so it's fixed color. Um, we do have gobo wheel, so and it does have little little pictures of what each gobo looks like based on the uh, fixtures. Uh, profile. So if I go ahead and hit that and then bring the focus back into view, you can see that I've brought my gobos up now. And you can separate them out between position and beam, position attributes, beam attributes. <coughs> and if you want, you can send everything to home using the home button right here. And you've got another level wheel right here as well snaps back and forth and yeah that's a quick look at uh, multi-parameter fixtures such as a moving light on the color source 20 console